This episode delves into a profound and provocative subject, often misunderstood by most men. The true desires of women in the bedroom. The Stoics, who were masters of human psychology, were more than just philosophers. They possessed a profound understanding of the dynamics between men and women. They emphasized that understanding oneself and those around one is the source of true wisdom. Today, we will examine how their timeless principles can transform one's intimate life. Stay with me until the end of the episode, as I will be providing seven powerful insights that will reveal the hidden desires of women in the realm of physical intimacy. The concepts of emotional depth connection and the mastery of one's own desires form the foundation of these insights, which go beyond mere superficial advice. If you find this episode enjoyable, please consider liking, subscribing, and leaving a comment. I would be delighted to hear your thoughts or even anecdotes regarding how Stoicism has impacted your relationships. Let us proceed to the first chapter. Chapter 1 Make a Noise Vocal feedback is one of the most frequently disregarded components of sexual intimacy. Contrary to societal expectations, Women are highly responsive to sound, particularly during intimate moments. Despite the societal expectation for men to remain silent and stoic during sex, vocal feedback is crucial. Vocal feedback extends beyond mere words, encompassing moans, breaths, and other sounds that express pleasure and desire. Sex is not merely a physical act. It is an emotional and psychological experience that women desire. Sound is a significant factor in establishing this connection. By making commotion during sex, you are providing her with a more profound sense of emotional engagement. Your vocal responses are confirmations that she is fulfilling her role, which is a powerful motivator for her. Desire and appreciation in the moment reassure women that they are providing pleasure. This can also enhance their own experience. Consider it this way. Women are highly perceptive, but they are not mind readers. When you remain silent or muted, you are leaving her in the dark, causing her to guess whether or not you are actually relishing the experience. How can a woman know she is driving you crazy if you remain quiet? Vocal feedback bridges the gap by providing her with a direct view of your enjoyment, enabling her to improve and feel more connected to you. Whether it is a deep breath or a sharp inhale of breath, Every sound you make during sex is a subtle signal of your contentment. It is common to assume that women are always confident in their sexual abilities, but the reality is that many women, like men, experience insecurities in the bedroom. A simple known whisper or gasp can have a powerful effect, ensuring that she feels secure and confident in her own sexuality. By being vocal, you are boosting her confidence and improving the overall experience for both of you. From a Stoic perspective, this is about being present in the moment. The Stoics underscored the significance of fully engaging in the present moment and avoiding the shackles of past or future concerns. They discussed the power of the present and how it enables one to experience the genuine pleasures of life by creating noise. You fully immerse yourself in the passionate moment releasing your inhibitions and proving to her your genuine investment in the experience. She can sense on a deeper level that you are present with her in that moment, not worrying about how others will perceive you or what will happen next. Vocal feedback is an act of emotional vulnerability, as many men are conditioned to suppress their emotions, even in intimate settings. However, stoicism does not equate emotional restraint with silence in moments of passion. The Stoics did not shy away from vulnerability. They viewed it as a sign of strength. Communicating your desires and confidence to let her hear them during sex shows that you are comfortable with yourself. Women often yearn for such unadulterated honesty, yet they often lack it. The emotional vulnerability of a man during sexual intercourse is equally significant as his physical prowess. They want to see and hear you fully engrossed in the moment savoring it to the fullest through your vocal expression. Making an emotional connection and building trust will strengthen your relationship now and in the future. In addition to conveying pleasure, vocal cues can also direct and guide the flow of your sexual experience. If something feels particularly good, inform her. 
If you are approaching your climax, let her hear the changes in your breathing or the intensity of your moans. This provides real-time feedback and enables both of you to adjust and build toward a more synchronized experience. Therefore, the next time, do not hesitate to express your enjoyment of her through sound, whether it be a soft moan of appreciation, a whisper in her ear, or a deep groan of satisfaction. In conclusion, it is important to remember that making noise in bed is not solely about pleasure. It is also about establishing a deeper emotional and psychological connection. Your vocal feedback will make her feel wanted, appreciated, and in control, as women want to have both their own and their partner's desires met. Women crave this kind of validation, as it reassures them that they are meeting their partner's expectations. Her pleasure. She first wants you to express your pleasure verbally, which will strengthen your relationship and help you reach new heights of satisfaction. While the Stoics were renowned for their composed demeanor, they would agree that silence is not always beneficial when it comes to passion. See Chapter 2 One of the most critical yet frequently disregarded aspects of sexual intimacy is prioritizing her pleasure. Many men, whether intentionally or unintentionally, engage in sexual activity with the intention of first gratifying their own desires, believing that their climax is the culmination of the experience. We all know that most men don't know this. The Stoics, who were adept at self-restraint and control, prioritized the needs of others over their own, particularly when it resulted in a greater good. In the context of intimacy, this entailed prioritizing the needs of the woman at the forefront of the experience. The man who prioritizes her happiness exhibits not only emotional intelligence, but also a profound comprehension of the reciprocal exchange that serves as the bedrock of any intimate relationship. A significant number of men rushing toward their own climax without fully engaging with her desires leaves their partner emotionally disconnected or unsatisfied. When a man dedicates time to her pleasure, it generates a profound sense of fulfillment that extends beyond the bedroom. This approach necessitates self-control and patience, qualities that the Stoics highly regarded. You show your commitment to her happiness by delaying your own climax and concentrating on her satisfaction. The experience is immensely more rewarding for both parties as you are engaging in a form of delayed gratification. Women value a man who is capable of regulating his impulses thereby extending the experience to provide her with the time and attention she merits. Her satisfaction becomes your objective, and as she comprehends your dedication to this endeavor, her attachment to you will intensify. Focusing on her climax fosters emotional intimacy in addition to physical satisfaction. A woman who feels valued and prioritized in bed will naturally feel more connected to her partner. She will appreciate that you are attentive to her needs and desires, which deepens the bond between you. This kind of emotional investment is rare, and when you provide it, you distinguish yourself from the vast majority of men. Prioritizing her pleasure should also include the journey you take her on, not just the climax. Women do not simply desire quick rushed sex. They want the build-up tension and excitement of knowing that their pleasure is at the forefront of your mind. By slowing down and fully immersing yourself in her satisfaction, you create a much more intense and fulfilling experience. It's not about racing towards the end. By savoring the moment and ensuring she enjoys every second of it, you can improve your communication in bed by focusing on her needs. You become more attuned to her body language. Her subtle cues and the sound she makes help you understand her likes and dislikes, allowing you to adapt and improve your technique. Over time, when a woman knows that you're actively paying attention to her responses, she'll feel more confident, more open, and more willing to express herself sexually. Ultimately, the man who puts her pleasure first stands out. Dream of being with a partner who is not selfish in bed, someone who is willing to take the time to explore, discover, and fulfill their desires. By embracing the stoic principles of patience, restraint, and control, you become that man. And in doing so, you create a sexual experience that is both deeply satisfying and emotionally enriching.
The third chapter focuses on play and afterplay. For many women, the emphasis on play and afterplay is the key factor that distinguishes an ordinary sexual encounter from an extraordinary one. When it comes to arousal, women have a different wiring than men, whereas men can arouse quickly. Thus, intimacy encompasses everything before and after foreplay, not just sex. The latter is essential for establishing a deeper connection, building anticipation, and ensuring that the sexual experience persists long after the physical act has concluded. Let us begin with foreplay. Women typically achieve the same level of arousal with additional time and stimulation. The act of foreplay is crucial in facilitating the full engagement of her body and mind in the experience. Rushing into sex without. The proper foreplay is akin to beginning a film halfway through, as it misses the buildup, tension and excitement that make the climax so much more gratifying from a stoic perspective. Foreplay is a time for preparation and mindfulness. The Stoics believed in the importance of taking the time to approach situations with intention and thoughtfulness. Similarly, approach foreplay with care, patience and focus instead of rushing through it. View it as an opportunity to connect with her on a deeper level through touch, kissing and whispering. Make her feel desired in every conceivable way by utilizing all of your senses to investigate her body and mind. While foreplay primarily focuses on physical stimulation, it also fosters the growth of emotional intimacy. Because women are emotionally responsive, foreplay shows that you value her happiness and comfort as much as yours. A well-planned foreplay session can foster a greater sense of connection, relaxation, and anticipation for the future. The period of intimacy that follows sex is just as important, but often overlooked after play. It is crucial for strengthening the emotional bond between partners. While many men tend to roll over or check out after sex, women appreciate a man who stays present and engaged, holding her talk and sharing a moment of tenderness afterward. This can make her feel cherished and respected. The Stoics would argue that the post-play period is an opportunity to reflect, a time to savor the moment of satisfaction and fulfillment, and to appreciate the connection you have established. Simple post-play involves being present with her and ensuring that intimacy continues after the sexual act. By dedicating time to both pre- and post-play, you are fostering a more comprehensive sexual experience. Women dream of feeling connected, valued, and appreciated before, during, and after the ACT. By prioritizing foreplay and afterplay, you are demonstrating to her that you are a man who recognizes the significance of emotional and physical intimacy. The Chapter 4 guide emphasizes the importance of intimacy in equal measure. Her women frequently harbor a covert desire for a man who is willing to assume responsibility in the bedroom. However, it is crucial to comprehend the true nature of this desire. Being dominant or forceful is not the same as taking command. It is about guiding her through the experience and demonstrating a quiet confidence in your actions. Stoicism imparts the ability to regulate one's emotions. Leadership, assurance, and emotional stability are all highly desirable qualities in a sexual partner. A man who is aware of his desires and is willing to guide the experience with a sense of purpose and presence is someone who will leave a lasting impression long after the encounter is over. Unfortunately, many men tend to be too passive in bed, waiting for their partner to take the lead, or constantly seeking approval. They are hesitant, unsure, and afraid to make a wrong move. However, the truth is that women desire a man who is confident enough to lead without being constantly second-guessing himself. They don't want to be the one making all the decisions or directing every action. Women yearn for a man who can confidently set the tone and establish an environment in which both partners can fully immerse themselves in the experience. Being the one to guide her does not entail disregarding her desires or being egotistical. Rather, it involves utilizing the information she provides to guide her in a manner that is both desired and fully engaged, while also ensuring that she feels secure. Consider it as assuming control of the situation while remaining attentive to her emotional and physical signals. The most effective form of leadership is one that is intuitive, responsive, and compassionate in which you establish the tone while still allowing her to express herself and feel empowered. 
It is not necessary to be complex in order to assume responsibility in the bedroom. Instead, it often involves small, subtle gestures that demonstrate confidence and control. It is crucial to take the lead in initiating change. Confidence in positions guide her with your hands or even maintain strong eye contact that clearly communicates your desire. These little acts of leadership are what make her feel like she's in the hands of someone who knows what they're doing. Confidence is key when a woman senses that you're in control, not in an overbearing way, but in a way that makes her feel safe, excited, and cherished. It heightens the entire experience for both of you. From a Stoic perspective, this confidence comes from self-mastery. The Stoics believed in being in control of one's own emotions and actions. And that sense of mastery is something women find incredibly attractive. When you take charge, you're showing her that you're a man who is deeply connected to his desires and knows how to direct them in a way that benefits both partners. You're not fumbling or hesitating. You're leading with purpose. This kind of leadership in the bedroom is a rare dynamic that many women dream of but rarely experience. And when they do, it's unforgettable. Of course, guiding her doesn't mean ignoring her wants or needs. The best leaders, even in intimate situations, are those who remain deeply connected to the people they are guiding. This means paying close attention to her body language, her breathing, and her vocal responses. When you listen to her reactions, you can adjust your approach to maximize her pleasure. You're not just dictating the experience you're leading her in a way that makes her feel deeply involved. Confidence and sensitivity should go hand in hand show her that you're the one in control but also make it clear that her pleasure and essay satisfaction are at the forefront of your mind. One of the secrets to guiding her is to be fully present in the moment, when you're truly in the moment. You'll notice the little things, the way her body moves, the sound she makes, and the subtle changes in her breathing. These are the cues you'll use to lead her. It's not about rushing to the finish line. It's about enjoying every moment of the journey and bringing her along with you when you show her that you're are not only taking charge but are also completely invested in making the experience as pleasurable as possible for her. You create an intimate connection that she'll remember long after the moment has passed. In the end, women desire a male who is both in control and deeply connected to their emotional and physical needs. By embodying the stoic qualities of confidence, self-mastery, and leadership, you can become the type of man who can take command in the bedroom while also making them feel safe cherished, and desired. She will dream of a man who is both a lover and a guide, who can simultaneously create a sense of safety and excitement, and who knows when to lead and when to listen. Chapter 5 The act of greeting is of importance. Kissing is one of the most intimate and powerful gestures during any erotic encounter. However, many men underestimate its significance for women. Kissing is not merely a prelude to sexual intercourse, it is an essential component of the experience. The manner in which you kiss. Duration and intensity of your kiss can set the mood for the entire experience. If you regard kissing as a mere warm-up, you are neglecting a potent instrument for cultivating greater intimacy and sexual gratification from a Stoic perspective. The Stoics believed in living with the present moment, and kissing can be interpreted as a means of maintaining this presence. You can deeply and passionately engage in the moment by kissing with intention and fully embracing each moment, demonstrating to her your complete focus on her. Beyond physical pleasure, it's about connecting emotionally and showing her you care. Passionate kissers not only captivate women during the initial stages of an encounter, but also beyond. A kiss can arouse desire, develop anticipation, and establish a strong emotional connection. However, the challenge lies in women's ability to distinguish between a man's superficial actions and genuine investment. Kissing not only enhances foreplay, but also serves as one of the most intimate acts you can perform during sex. A deep, meaningful kiss conveys that you are fully engaged, present, and deeply desiring her, while a lazy, half-hearted kiss communicates a lack of interest and passion. This connection transcends the physical act of intercourse. Deep kisses during sex enhance the emotional intensity and personalize the experience. A fantasy for many women. Kissing her during intimacy shows that your focus is not just on the act, 
but also on her as a whole person. In fact, many women dream of a partner who does not rush through or abandon kissing once the experience becomes more intense. Kissing throughout the experience keeps the connection alive and demonstrates that you are in tune with her body, emotions, and desires. Women value men who comprehend the significance of a well-timed kiss, regardless of whether it is delicate and gentle or passionate and fiery. By engaging with her through kissing, you establish a more profound connection that will leave a lasting impression. Kissing is also a form of nonverbal communication that transcends the realm of language. Every kiss is an opportunity to communicate your emotions and desires without saying a word, and women notice this subtle but powerful form of connection. The way you kiss can tell her everything she needs to know about how you feel in that moment. Are you tender? Are you hungry for her? Are you showing her that you are fully present? It is important to remember that kissing is an act that should be present not only before and during sex but also after posts. CX kissing or afterplay serves to reinforce emotional intimacy and connection. It is a gesture that communicates that the experience was not solely about physical delight but also about the creation of something meaningful together. Women secretly crave the kind of attention that comes with kissing, which extends beyond the end of the sexual encounter. By continuing to kiss her afterward, you demonstrate your appreciation for her not only for her physical attributes, but also for the emotional bond you share. Kissing is not merely a physical act. It is a sentimental one that women aspire to. By being intentional with your kisses, you can transform an ordinary sexual encounter into something extraordinary, leaving her craving more of the emotional and physical connection you have created. This is particularly true for partners who comprehend the depth of a kiss and can use it to communicate passion, desire, and love. Eye contact is one of the most potent yet underutilized instruments for establishing profound sexual intimacy. When executed correctly, eye contact can elevate the entire sexual experience, transforming it from a strictly physical encounter into a profound emotional connection. Women dream of being with a partner who isn't afraid to look into their eyes during sex and who uses eye contact as a way to communicate desire, trust, and vulnerability. From a stoic point of view, my contact is about being fully present and embracing the moment without fear or distraction. The stoics believed in facing life head-on with courage and honesty, and in the bedroom, this translates into maintaining strong, confident eye contact. It shows that you're fully engaged, that you're not afraid of intimacy, and that you're connecting with her on a level beyond the physical. Contact during sex can be incredibly vulnerable, but that's exactly why so powerful women desire a partner who can meet their gaze during intimate moments. When a man demonstrates emotional vulnerability by gazing into a woman's eyes rather than merely gazing at her physical appearance, he creates an experience that is deeply personal and unforgettable. Another aspect of eye contact is that it can heighten sexual tension when you maintain eye contact during moments of passion. It creates a powerful magnetic energy that draws you both closer. Women dream of being with, with a man who can make them feel this level of intensity where every glance and every look holds meaning. It's a form of silent communication where a simple look can convey passion, desire, or even love. But eye contact isn't just about the climax. It should be present throughout the entire experience. From foreplay to afterplay, keeping eye contact can create a sense of continuity and connection. Whether you're kissing her, touching her, or making love to her, meeting her gaze shows that you're truly there with her experiencing each moment together. This kind of attention is something that many women secretly long for, but rarely get for some men maintaining eye contact during sex can feel intimidating especially if they've been taught to focus on the physical aspects of the encounter. But here's the truth. Women are emotional beings, and they crave emotional connection, just as much if not more than physical pleasure. By looking into her eyes, you're acknowledging her emotions, her desires, and her need for connection. You're saying without words, emotional bond, I am here to support you, and I am with you. I have finally reached out to Helen in order to establish a sense of mutual respect and equality. By gazing into her eyes, you are treating her as an equal partner in the experience, 
rather than just someone who is present to fulfill your desires. You are demonstrating to her that her presence, emotions, and pleasure are important to you, which is a quality that many women aspire to but rarely find in a partner. Therefore, the next time you are in the bedroom, do not hesitate to hold her gaze. Let her see you and demonstrate that you are fully committed to her. Presenting this minor act can elevate the erotic experience to a level of significance that surpasses mere physical pleasure. Women yearn for this type of connection, and by perfecting the art of contact, you can become the type of male who can offer it. The seventh chapter, Maintain the Level of Excitement. There is no quicker way to kill sexual desire than through routine. Women yearn for a companion who is willing to maintain an exciting atmosphere in the bedroom and is not apprehensive about experimenting with novel concepts. Experiment with novel concepts and maintain your enthusiasm. The Stoics were aware that life is about embracing change and novelty. They believed in constantly challenging oneself and exploring new ways to approach life's experiences. In the same way, your approach to intimacy should involve a willingness to experiment and adapt, whether it's trying out a new position, introducing a new form of foreplay, or bringing in an element of surprise. Sexual spontaneity and creativity are essential for maintaining a fulfilling and dynamic sexual relationship, and the man who embraces these qualities is the one she will always think about. By maintaining a dynamic and thrilling environment, she will perceive that the sexual experience is perpetually changing. Women exhibit a strong desire. Despite the fact that they may occasionally appreciate a particular rhythm or routine, they also yearn for spontaneity in the bedroom. When sex becomes predictable, it loses its sparkle. Women desire a male who is self-assured enough to take the lead, yet also creative enough to maintain the excitement. This may entail engaging in role-playing or varying the location or timing of their interactions. It is crucial to preserve a sense of adventure. Women desire a sexual relationship that is filled with potential and excitement, rather than one that is stagnant or routine. This does not necessitate being wild every time, but it does require an openness to change and a constant pursuit of ways to improve the experience. This can range from small changes such as beginning with a massage or utilizing various forms of touch, to larger explorations, such as exploring new fantasies together. She will experience a perpetual sense of engagement by maintaining the pace of the situation. Additionally, it is crucial to consider her fantasies and desires in order to maintain the excitement. By being open-minded and willing to explore new ideas, you demonstrate to her that you are interested in fulfilling her desires, as many women have unspoken fantasies or desires that they may feel too bashful to discuss. This level of attentiveness is the ideal that women seek in a partner, someone who is attuned to their needs and enthusiastic about investigating new territory. Communication is essential when it comes to experimenting with novel concepts. It is essential to establish a secure and comfortable environment in which she feels comfortable expressing her desires. This will sustain the excitement in the relationship. Discuss with her what interests her, what she is curious about, and what turns her on. Women yearn for a partner who is receptive, empathetic, and enthusiastic about delving into their imaginations. Finally, it is necessary to exert effort in order to maintain the excitement. Once they establish a sexual routine, many men may believe they no longer need to exert the same level of effort. However, women desire a man who is constantly seeking ways to reignite the passion, whether it be by being spontaneous, introducing new forms of foreplay, or simply putting in extra effort to make each encounter memorable. At the conclusion of the day, your willingness to go above and beyond will distinguish you. Maintaining an exciting atmosphere in the bedroom is not merely a matter of attempting new things. It is also a demonstration of your commitment to a passionate and vivacious sexual relationship. The stoic principle of constant growth and change is the kind of partner that women dream of, one who never lets the flame die out, who is always thinking about how to keep things exciting, and who makes every encounter feel fresh and new. By doing so, you transform into a partner who keeps her constantly engaged, anticipating the next exciting adventure you will embark on.
This is the experience she wants and will keep her coming back. So there you have it. You can transform your sexual relationship by adopting the principles of Stoicism and understanding the hidden desires of women in the boudoir. These methods include maintaining excitement, maintaining eye contact, and providing vocal feedback. In each chapter, we have examined methods to enhance your connection, resulting in a more intimate and pleasurable experience. It is important to remember that the goal is not to simply check off a list of techniques, but to fully embrace the moment, remain present, and be confident in your own desires while remaining attentive to hers. You can achieve stoicism by combining emotional vulnerability with strength. With a genuine passion and mastery of self-control, you will create experiences that women dream of, but rarely achieve. If you found these insights to be beneficial, please share your experiences or perspectives on how these ideas resonate with you by liking this video, subscribing to receive additional provocative content, and leaving a comment below. Do you have any experience with these strategies? What have you found to be the most effective in your relationships? Let's begin the conversation and remember that the goal is not merely to make her dream of you in the bedroom, but to establish a final meaningful connection that transcends the physical. Take the knowledge you have gained from this article and apply it. Watch as it transforms not only your sex life, but your entire relationship. I appreciate your attention and look forward to our next episode. Continue to cultivate the art of intimacy and remain stoic and resilient.